And long story short, he, Jared got better. And, you know, he was dating his high school sweetheart. He was doing all of these things, right? And then because of the treatment of the cancer, wound up getting a rare form of leukemia, if mm. I remember correctly. And um, wound up passing away. Oh, wow. And so when Dave went to, to visit, it was actually <laughs> Jared was supposed to get on an airplane to go visit uh, the family and so forth. It was around holidays. And when Dave went to go visit the family because of everything that had just happened, his sister brought him upstairs and showed him a little journal and that Jared had left. And his perspective at the time was this is probably going to be a very angry journal. Right. Sure. Right. Yeah. You know, as any teenage boy, that would be a natural thing, right? Of Have course. his whole life ahead any of age, him, right? Any age, yeah. And he, he starts reading this journal and he's like, Well, you know, that's that's interesting because it's not anger. And he gets to a place where it says, Jared was writing, I'm grateful that God gave me cancer and not my parents. Wow. I'm grateful that God gave me cancer and not my siblings. I'm grateful that God gave me cancer and not my cousins, who was Dave's kids. Now, where did he learn that? Bro. That's amazing. I'm grateful that God gave me cancer so that I'm, I was here to show how to be strong. And that perspective of shifting and embracing gratitude, if you do nothing but that alone, that will change your life. Okay.